Hello everybody, welcome back to yet another review. Today we're going to be taking a look at Patrick Pace, a custom cars diecast of mine. More specifically, this is him and his protectors of Radiator Springs paint job. For those of you who don't know, Patrick Pace is a custom car of mine from my Cars Adventure series, which, it's obligatory plug time, will be returning this March with Cars Adventures Lap 2, a brand new continuation series. It's a great jumping on point for those of you who want to start watching the series. Uh, so yeah, this again is Patrick Pace and his Protectors of Radiator Springs design. This used to be Charlie Checker, and then I turned it into Patrick Pace. Then in August of last year, I made it into this Protectors of Radiator Springs variant. Um, ideally, I'd like to have two Patrick Paces, one to have in his regular paint job and one for the Protectors one. But until then, we're stuck with this guy and his Protectors look. So let's take a closer look here. This Charlie Checker release had raised eyelids. This is actually his 2018 release, pre-Thailand. Now, uh, Charlie Checker is out in a two-pack now, I believe, with Cars 1 McQueen. That, of course, is his Thailand variant. So, uh, I didn't change the expression from what was already there since, again, he had raised eyelids. As you can see, he has some blue eyes there. And on his hood, we have RSPD written in purple. It used to be written in, I believe, silver. Um, that stands for Radiator Springs Police Department. The purple and black color scheme comes from the protectors of Radiator Springs. We also have his silver headlights and the light bar up here, which I really don't like the fact that you could still see part of Charlie Checker underneath it, but there wasn't anything I could do about that. We have Pro written on the side. All the protectors of Radiator Springs have Pro written somewhere. See on that side as well. Before it was this version of Patrick, this was actually silver. In fact, when I first made him, all this was gold and he had different eyes and everything. But now, of course, you can see this is red and blue with silver in the middle. And this area has been uh, changed to be white instead of silver. For a little while, I had a golden star drawn on the side. That ended up looking really bad. And I finally changed it to, say, Pro. On the back, he used to have RSPD written, but now it's just his uh, lights back there. And again, we've got Pro written on that side. Moving on to the base, you could see a complete and total mess. I really need to repaint this thing. I used to paint the bases of my customs. It's something that I still uh, want to do more frequently since Mattel never does it. It's a little additional detail I like to add. I also have to paint over his wheels there. What may just look like a mistake, this silver streak is actually supposed to be there. This silver line is an injury he received from Miss Fritter back in 2018. And I still have it there painted on his base to this day. Anyway guys, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Make sure to check out my blog for some more stuff. I recently did a post uh, discussing Cars Adventures Lap 2 if you're interested. So make sure to check that out. I'll see you guys next time. Bye now.